Welcome to Top Car Channel. What is it? The S Cross may not have sold in the numbers Maruti Suzuki hoped for, but this crossover is still a very significant model for India's largest automaker. Launched in 2015, it was the first car for the company to be sold out of the new and upmarket Nexa retail network. And with the Grand Vitara and the Kaisashi bowing out, the S Cross is the flagship and the most premium offering of the range. No wonder then, that despite selling a humble, for Maruti, 53,000 units in two years, the company is not giving up on it. The S Cross is back with a fresh face, a host of tweaks and for the first time, a mild hybrid system. The biggest change is to the face in a bid to address the S Cross biggest weakness, its uninspiring looks. In fact, this is more than a facelift, with almost everything forward of the windscreen, apart from the fenders, completely new. The S Cross gets a muscular new bonnet, with strong character lines that are visible even from the driver's viewpoint. What really catches your attention and is the large, toothy grille with strong chrome accents. The new headlights look very high-tech and remind of the previous generation BMW 5 series. But it's only the top alpha model that gets LED projector lights and LED daytime running lamps, while the lower three variants make do with halogens. The front is rounded off by an eye-catching new bumper and the overall design, while not classically pretty, is quite striking and certainly enhances the road presence of the S-Cross. Changes to side are quite minimal, like most midlife updates, but the car does get new machine-polished 16-inch wheels that look quite fetching. At the rear, the more observant will notice a new LED tail lamp design.